Zebra Herd, welcome back to New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. Today, we are moving on to World 3, and along with it, trying out yet another character. Of course, we've tried Mario and Toadette slash Peach Hat. Now, we're gonna be moving on to good old Luigi here. Of course, back down the five lives because of that, but I'm sure we'll be a-okay. So, as you can see, we can either go up the Frosted Glacier, back to the left for Layer Cake Desert, or down for Sparkling Waters. I think for today's episode, we will do Sparkling Waters and see how things go. Here we are, Sparkling Waters. Looks very beautiful. There's Boom Boom, there's a bunch of Cheep Cheeps flip flopping around, a baby Yoshi. And lastly, Larry Koopa, cool. So where does this lead? Okay, this is sort of like a teleport spot. Oh, that's interesting. I like that. So there we go, we're just gonna do Spark. Wait, yeah, I'm already here. I don't need to launch this somewhere I already am. Or will I? <laughs> what, what a flight. All right, so let's head into Sparkling Waters 1, Water Spout Beach. And hope everything turns out okay here as Luigi. I can only hope, right? So we'll do what we can. And of course, it was a ghost house. So that should be our first ever ghost house in this game. That'll be really exciting. Um, and Luigi should actually control a little bit different than Mario. He should have a higher jump. So that'll be interesting, for sure. I don't know if he's maybe a little slower than Mario. I mean, I think he has a higher jump. He definitely does in uh, New Super Luigi U. But maybe I'm wrong, maybe he doesn't have a higher jump here. It's sort of hard to tell. <laughs> but anyways, we'll just give it our best shot and see what ends up happening. I mean, it's just really cool to be able to play as a different character that isn't Mario in single player New Super Mario Bros. I mean, I know, like I said before, in New Super Mario Bros. DS, you could definitely play as Luigi. I can't remember if you could play with him in New Super Mario Bros. 2, but maybe you could. Anyways, I threw that the wrong way. Gotta be careful, these crab dudes are not very fun to deal with, but I'll do what I can. I'll throw him, once again, throw him the wrong way. And now we can jump off the little balls they throw. What do we wanna do here? I think we just wanna wait and go. Not bad, actually, good throw right there. Uh, okay, so I like that. I'm gonna go ahead and try to grab some of these. You know what, I probably should have thrown the ice down, but it's fine, we got it. Pretty gosh darn good, we got ourselves a what up, and we're good. Whoa, 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 darn it. <laughs> that is not what I meant to do. Luigi definitely feels a little bit different to control, so certainly something I have to get used to throughout today's episode, but it'll be well worth it. This is definitely something I can go into. No, really? Okay, if you say so. Boop, got it. That is another ice flower, which I will gladly throw over there. And I'll throw this over there as well. Ooh, that is definitely something I can get into. So, oh, I can't freeze those? Well, now I know. I'm gonna go ahead and go down this pipe and maybe get to our third star coin. Oh, no, just one up. I'm a little worried about this. Oh, hopefully the giant fish don't show up, right? The giant fish that eat you in one gulp and they're always ridiculous? I suppose not, that's good. We do have to work hard to earn a lot of lives, so I might wanna be diligent with getting coins, because every time you switch to a new character, if you haven't played that character before, you do have to start over with their lives. We only have eight right now, so we got a lot of work to go if we wanna make sure that we're sort of safe from mistakes. Hmm. So go up like that, throw that there. Hey, hey, watch it, there we go. And do what we can with all this. Got it. Booty slam onto him. That was really good. Nothing over this way. Just trying to look around for any kind of hidden little areas. Because we're still missing one star coin, and I feel like we're getting to the end of this level soon, so. Probably something with this power block, actually. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is, got it. Don't wanna, I wanna make sure that doesn't sink. So there we go, all three star coins have been obtained, which means we can move out of here. Look at that, easy peasy, so we're good. Oh, and look at that, we ended with the clock on 188, so we should get an extra power up for that one. <laughs> Luigi, phew, made it. Glad he is relieved. Oh, hello, Toad. What do you got for us? Thanks a million for your help. Here, take this. We get a star. Hey, not bad, I'll take it. So with that being done, might as well just keep moving forward. See what else we can run into. Looks like we got quite a lot in front of us, starting with, uh, the second level of this world. I like how we have like a bit of a repeating pattern there with the items. It's like star crown, star crown. Wish that mushroom wasn't there. I could waste it right now. Oh, I can't use it. Never mind. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so determined to get the pattern. Anyways, sparkling waters to tropical refresher. Let's go for it. Hopefully it is actually refreshing and not deflating or something because it might be if it's tough. This is a nice little area. Oh, this is definitely a little thing. Got it, some easy coins. Whoa, look at our score. We have exactly 1,100,000 points. 
pretty cool. Oh no. This does not seem refreshing so far, I gotta be honest. So the ice power up actually isn't too helpful here because these guys will eventually break out of that ice. So a fire flower is a lot more of what I'm talking about here. Can I go up this way? No, there's like a ceiling. Lots of coins hanging out, but they're sort of going away. Oh, I don't trust that, it's trying to bring me down. I do feel like there's an area that tries to bring you down though and it brings you to a star coin. Is that here? I don't think so. So we have no baby Yoshi to break us out of this one. We're gonna have to be very careful we don't want to run into bloopers. So, not really looking forward to that too much right now. Got it, got it. Nothing else going on over that way. I, I like how you can see some cheap cheap in the background as well. That, that's actually a really cool touch. Get rid of this dude. Got him. No like power ups to find down there. That yellow pipe might have something. Got it. I'm trying to just get rid of these guys. Oh, you're protecting the star coin. I see that. Come on, get rid of them. And got it. Star coin number one. So we haven't missed anything yet. Uh, that's a relief. Oh, that was scary. That was really close. But I still want to check this yellow pipe because there's a yellow pipe over here. So maybe one of them's an entrance, one of them's an exit. You never know until you try. So we're gonna head down this way. Uh, it pushes us down and gives us some coins. That's that's sort of weird, but I like it. Give me those, and we're good. Keep moving forward this way. So there's like an upper path and a lower path. If they're all like little switches, weird. Okay, I got this, come on. Very good, I'm trying to just get as many coins as possible. I can't get rid of those big dudes out. So we still have plenty to worry about. I wish that getting these guys, if you got enough of them, would like get you a one up or something, but I guess it doesn't. So I'm just trying to get the ones that aren't too risky, you know? I don't wanna try to get coins that are just gonna get me hit when I really don't need to get hit right now. What about this one, is this one a switch? You bet it is. Gets me plenty of coins if I don't miss them. Got him, good job Luigi. I feel like he's a better swimmer than Mario, but that not, might not be the case. Oh, look at all these. Nice, okay, I'll grab them. It's just the first couple levels I have to be really attentive to getting as many coins as I can. There we go. That way if we do run into some tough stuff later on, I won't be too stuck with it. Here's another one of these. I don't trust it, I feel like there might be no, nope, okay. I swear, maybe it's not this game, but there's been a new Super Mario Bros. game where there's been a down current just like that, and if you ride it downwards, you get into a secret area. So it's like, that's a little weird that they would do it that way. No, I wanted to get a power up. Oh no. Oh well, it's fine. Get back into it. I mean, I just got the checkpoint, so I figured it was a good time to try that. I feel like I wasn't all that wrong. Oh gosh, ooh, ooh, scary. So that second star coin has to be around here soon. Oh boy, dodge this guy. Oh, you know what, it is definitely under here. Or is it? Well, there's coins falling, but are any of these star coins? I don't think so. Like, I would love to get them, but, oh, there it is, 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 there it is. Oh, I got it, star coin number two is gotten. Very good, but what about this pipe? Oh, I don't trust this. I don't trust this one bit. Yeah, okay, we got it. This has to be something good. Maybe even star coin number three. Maybe it's behind that big dude. Do we get a star? Oh, you bet we do. Okay, got him, got him. No star coin though, that's a shame. But we can keep moving and maybe we'll be able to find it a bit more easily with this. Come on, get that guy. Get these dudes, can we get a one up? Come on, ah, oh, not quite a one up. We we'll need a little bit more, I needed to get rid of that other big dude. Hard to move fast under the water. If we can get the penguin suit soon, which is in this game, it's just not very common. Looking at that soon, things might turn out well. So what about this pipe? This is definitely another one. Hopefully offering up. Oh no, no. I remember this. If you don't have the star, which is, oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to get a power up somewhere and then just get hit and get it because there's no other way I really can, is there? I don't even know if that's gonna work out. Okay, well here's my mushroom, so my one, and only chance to make this work, so don't get hit by the cheap cheeps. Or this guy. Perfect, so what I have to do, and this might not even work, but I'm pretty sure it's what we gotta do. We'll find out. Keep falling, grab the star coin, and then go up super fast. No, it didn't work! The invincibility doesn't last long enough. I have to use that star then, that's really tough. 
Oh, that's it. I totally forgot that was a thing in Mario games. So if you have a star and hit a question block with the star, you end up getting a second star. So like while the star power is activated, I forgot about that. That's all I needed that entire time. So I got it now. We got a couple one-ups out of it too, which is good because I needed those one-ups back. And now I can go and complete the level. I'm just a dingus. It was all my fault. Don't, don't blame the game. It was me. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so I did it this time, that's good. Let's go ahead and do the uh, one-up hut, because definitely Luigi could use a couple of extra lives. So if we could get like four or five here, that'd be perfect. We're pretty used to this mini game now. You just gotta jump, grab the one-ups, avoid the Bowsers, and hopefully everything turns out okay. Maybe even grab a couple coins along the way as well. That'd be useful. See if we, oh gosh. All right, already doing not so well. I'm at zero. Come on, let's try this again. Ready, got it. And got it, that was good. Now we're up to two. And three and four. Nice, I avoided that last Bowser one. Got it, that's five right there. So if we can just grab a couple more one-ups. No, I no, it was gonna be a new high score. Wait, okay, at least it was back to five, I think. Could have been six, that would have been my newest new high score, but we got in total seven, but then I got two Bowsers. All right, well that's good. That's still pretty good. We got Luigi all the way up to 17 lives, pretty good. Okay. So now that we've done that, we're gonna keep moving forward and head into this one. This is Sparkling Water's Castle, or Tower actually. Giant Skewer Tower with Boom Boom at the top. It's only been Boom Boom recently. I honestly thought there were some towers that didn't have Boom Boom. Maybe I'm wrong? I don't know. I wish Pom Pom was in this game. I'm pretty sure she's not. That would've been really cool. Oh, yeah, the giant skewers, what do you know? These things are usually quite tough. Whenever you see these things in a tower or in a castle, you know that level just stepped up a notch. It's gonna be a lot more difficult. So we got like an ice power up over there I might grab. First, I'm just checking things out, seeing where I might be able to find some stuff. Just check the corners and such. Okay, nothing over that way. What about over here? I'm not sure, nope. Because I don't think there's any particular secret exits in this world. There's just the uh, ghost mansion secret exit. I think that's the only one. So this might be very dangerous, but I think that, yeah, look at this. See, it was dangerous, but worth doing. We'll check the other one as well. That will bound to be having something, right? Okay, wait here. And as soon as we can, move, move, move. There's at least a little place to hide so that we can wait for this to do its thing, because there's nothing here. Yeah. Oh, there's, yeah, there's blocks here. Oh, duck and cover. That is really scary. I don't like it. Okay, keep going up, keep going up. Good job, Luigi. And to the right, there's not much. What about to the left? Hmm, nothing, but there is like something. Oh, then maybe, before I continue on, this is really risky. Yeah, look at that. Well, did that really get me anything? I guess not. <laughs> Weird. Oh, well, there's a red coin thing, I guess. I mean, not really what I was looking for. Oh, okay, this is a star coin right here. This might just be what I need. So I might be searching all that other stuff for nothing and risking everything. There we go, star coin number two. Pretty good. Look at all these coins. They're all so happy for me. So we get another ice flower, which I suppose I'll just leave here in the case that, oh, there's no way I'm, I'm gonna be able to get it now. Oh gosh, oh no, no, come on! Luigi's head's a little taller than Mario's. He wasn't able to get away there. That stinks. Okay, get up here. Oh, this is tough, but you might notice that there is a platform down this way. And does that have anything really besides these bricks? Oh, that's not really what I meant to do. Not what I had intended at the least. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Very odd that he even has it like that. Could there be anything in here? There could be, but it doesn't look like it. Okay, yeah, let, it, let that do its thing, do its thing. And we got a one-up, which, cool, but I don't know. Oh, 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 what is this? Looks like we got ourselves a secret pipe. If it could be star coin number three, that'd be very good. Okay, well, it just turns all this stuff into coins. Let me get a power up like this, and then I'll get up there and we'll start doing some stuff. Got it. Got rid of that dude, pretty good. One of these has to be a power up, right? There it is, acorn suit would be really cool to get. And what about in here? Nothing. So yeah, an acorn suit and a tower. No, 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 don't lose it, don't lose it. <laughs> I wanna keep this, you know. I feel like I'm playing worse today than I was last episode. So let me try to get, 
nothing over there, okay. Had to make sure there are secrets everywhere. Okay, there's the last star coin, and there goes my raccoon suit. No! Oh, come on, I'm jumping too high. <laughs> Luigi's too good of a jumper. Okay, this is a bit risky. Oh, no, 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 come on. Why didn't I just duck and cover? I thought there was no room to do so. That was really silly of me, I'm sorry. Okay, so I ended up getting an extra power up, and it's been helping out a lot, so I really don't mind doing it. I have not been playing very well with Luigi. I, I don't know what it is. I guess maybe it really might be his higher jump that's been messing me up, because I'm pretty sure it is a higher jump. It definitely is in other games where you can play as Luigi. And is there any power-ups over here? There's gotta be something. That seems weird that there's a big open gap, but I didn't find anything. It's fine, I have the acorn suit, we'll be okay. We just gotta go and deal with this boss. So, there's Kamek, there's Boom Boom. Last time he learned a new power, what is he gonna learn this time? Look at Luigi with his dukes up, he's ready to go. He's like, bring it on, Boom Boom. Oh, he can jump now, so can we. I mean, luckily, we can handle that pretty well. He's gonna get back up, and then I'm just gonna immediately hit him again. I sort of feel bad doing that, but if it works, oh no, I jumped too soon that time. That's fine, we got him. <laughs> this is the first time I've taken any damage from Boom Boom, I think. All right, well, it was a struggle, but we got it done with Luigi, which is the most important thing. And we're gonna keep moving forward. So, let's see what's going on now. So we can either go to the thing, or that's all we can go to. I thought that was gonna open up a path to the right. Oh no, here we go again. Kamek isn't happy that we beat up Boom Boom, so he's making that storm even worse. We can't even see the castle anymore. It's a tornado. Poor Princess Peach, we gotta help her. <laughs> Bowser evilly cackling. All right, yeah, we'll definitely save, and then we'll move on to the next level, which is gonna be right here. It is the haunted boat, the sparkling water's ghost house, sort of, haunted shipwreck. This is gonna be cool. Awesome, I remember we were on a haunted ship, was I think Super Mario World. So this is gonna be super cool. I'll try my best to find all the star coins on the first try, and then get to the secret exit afterwards. Are you really gonna be throwing stuff at me here, sir? I don't like it. Okay, so it seems like there's gonna be lots of tricky stuff around here. Oh, oh, okay, I can just go this way. Grab that, and I'll be back for you soon enough. I wanted to make sure I'm not missing anything over here first. Because these things sort of circle around. Get up like that, perfect. And, ooh, already a door. It's a fake one, but a door nonetheless. I mean, I guess it's not a door at that point if it's not real. Anyways, going this way. Oh, there's nothing else over here, okay. Had to make sure. So I need to ride this back up, but yeah. Like most ghost houses, or at least ghost levels, this has a secret exit that we need to find. Oh, there's a one-up, can I get to that? No, there, it's gone, it's, it's most definitely gone. Oh well, I tried. What about under here? Nothing? All right. Ooh, watch out for that boo. Oh boy. I'm okay, I'm okay. Nothing on this side either. Trying to be very diligent. I love that the poles return. These poles were in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, I think. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Definitely a secret down this way. Oh, no, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. I gotta get the star coin. How do I get to it? That's not right. There's gotta be a way in there. If not from here, then from where? Maybe I could just go up and loop around. And then, you slide down like this, and then, there it is. Okay, can you move a little bit? Thank you. Oh, a little too close for comfort, buddy. There's our first star coin. Awesome stuff. Nothing over this way, so I think we're gonna get through this door. I can only hope, right? And let's see what's going on. Uh, anything in the corner? Not really looking like it. Ooh, be careful. Yeah, let them separate a little bit. I love all their silly expressions. That's straight out of Super Mario World. Whoop. Can I go through these? I cannot. You gotta like check literally every surface when it comes to these kind of levels. Cause you never know which one, ow, is gonna have something you're looking for. There's a star coin over there. Oh, come on. Now I'm down to nothing. This is bad. Gosh darn it. <laughs> come on. Okay, so I'm doing it a little bit better. I don't wanna speak too soon. Don't wanna speak too soon for sure. But there's star coin number two. So I am struggling to push forward. I'm gonna sort of go down the side of this one and see if there's any openings. There's not, so let's fly back up. Swim back up, what am I talking about flying? 
We don't have the acorn suit. <laughs> All right, so with that done, I'm gonna keep moving forward with this one. This room seems like it could be a bit more manageable. Oh, there it is, circle number three. <laughs> All right, so I'm sure there are some secrets laying around here, but I'm not as worried about those. We can find the secret exit later. I'm just trying to find out how I actually get out of here. This is another fire flower. I guess I'll take it, because it was sort of in my way to move forward this way. I think we're probably near the end. This is so confusing. Here, come this way. Whoop, thank you. Oh, that was fake. Come on, ow, oh, you stinker, I was gonna jump over you. Ah, the game pulling tricks on me. Getting rid of my fire flower. Ooh, it's not being nice today. So what is this way? It has to be the exit. So that's probably the secret exit, probably somewhere else in that maze room. Have to keep an eye out for it. Oh, this is such a cool background. I like this one a lot. Oh no, <laughs> come on, I gotta be able to do that right. Let's try that again, maybe. Ooh, so. One, no, come on, it's, it's, a, it's a lot harder than it looks, okay? Luigi's a lot to get used to. Oh my gosh, if I don't do it this time, I'll just go and end the level. There we go, that beautiful triple jump is gonna get us the course clear. He made it. So now we gotta do the level again, but try to find that secret exit. Hopefully that won't be too much work, but you never know. This has been a really tough world so far. And... Ooh, nice. This is opening up. There's baby Yoshi. And let's hop back in, try to find that secret exit. Okay, so it looks like there was a little bit of an opening over there in the ceiling. Let's try to get back over there. Like, yeah, like, maybe here? Uh, not quite. There's definitely something around here. I don't know what it is, but I have a feeling, oh, maybe here? Oh, oh, come on, there's a ghost in the way. But that's definitely gonna be something. If I get taken out by a boo and I have to do this over again, I will not be happy. Maybe this is, um, okay, never mind. No, 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 this is where I'm normally supposed to go. This is so confusing, because there's it's so hard to tell where I'm supposed to go, where I'm not. Can I get a power up here? Because I'd really appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, so I got that. So this is where we're normally supposed to go. Come on, boo, this guy stinks right now. He uses all up in my business. It has to be somewhere, I know it is. I just gotta figure out where. Everything looks the same. Oh, here we go, this might be something. Uh, jump for it. Oh, come on, I know I can make that jump, I just did, I just, oh, game. Come on, why can't I make it anymore, what the heck? <laughs> this is driving me nuts. Oh my gosh, I can't make it. What happened? <laughs> Luigi, come on. Ah, oh, that is super tough. You gotta like, right at the tip of your jump. Makes me think this isn't actually the way to do it. I am so confused right now, I gotta be honest. Having Luigi be bigger though would definitely help. So Boo, if you could just please move it, dude. I know I can do it, he just barely touches it. There it is, see, was that so tough? Oh my gosh. What, the, what was with that jump? Is it so tough to make? Okay, definitely grabbing these coins because I need more lives as Luigi as soon as possible. I mean, I got 20 of them, so I guess I'm fine. But this definitely is the secret exit. No doubt about it. We're going up this red pipe. And yeah, looking like oh, it's all foggy and misty and mysterious. Oh, there's more than one crash ship. Spooky. Is there like invisible blocks somewhere? Most likely. Oh well. One, two, oh, I was trying to, for the triple jump. I don't know, didn't work, it's fine. Secret exit found, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Luigi going, oh, secret, shh. I like that. He's so much more like fun than Mario. And so he's like, Mario's fun, don't get me wrong, he's very fun. Luigi's different in such a refreshing way. So the mass of the ship falls down and a whole bunch of debris pops up and that's gonna lead somewhere. I love the secret exits, they're so satisfying because they have like this whole cool looking path to them. Okay, so now that we've done that, we got tons of things to check out. I think we wanna go this way for now. Try to snag that baby Yoshi friend. Hey baby Yoshi, how you doing? And can we, I guess we can't do anything there. I wanna try getting these cheap cheeps with the baby Yoshi and see what ends up happening. Cause these guys will give us power so if we do this correctly, and I can really use some power up. So there we go, that's pretty good so far. Oh, we can get a star here too. So this actually might not be so bad. Whoa, whoa, baby Yoshi, baby Yoshi, baby Yoshi. Come on, oh you just sort of float in the water. Okay, that's not too big of a deal then. There we go, we got them all, that was pretty good. And, we get a peach at crown. He's like, I don't want a peach at crown, I'm out of here. Uh, 
That's not good. I, I, I like those, but I need to be playing as Toadette to use it. That's sort of the biggest complaint I have. I don't think you should be able to get Peachette crowns if you're playing as a character that is not Peachette. Because like then it's just like, that could have been a power-up I could have used, and I really do need more power-ups. There we go. We're gonna try taking this one on as well to see if we can't get some more stuff. We do have to be careful. Once again, I don't wanna lose the baby Yoshi. I also don't want to get hurt if I don't have to. There we go. And boom, what do we get? Oh, nice, a propeller cap. I forgot those were even in this game. That's exciting. Oh, I can't wait to use that. I don't know when I should, but I definitely should at some point. Okay, so propeller cap is mine. Very nice. We're gonna figure out what level we're going to next. I think it's just Sparkling Waters 3. Yep, here it is, Sparkling Waters 3, above the cheap, cheap seas. Some more cheap, cheaps coming in at us. This has been a long episode for me. Like, I don't think it's gonna be as long as you guys, because I'll be cutting out all the fails, of course, but it's already like over 40 minutes for me. Like, isn't that crazy? Lots of work going into this one. And we're just going up this way. Oh, so it's like waterfalls with cheap cheeps in them. That so, sounds both cool and scary. Is there gonna actually be a Yoshi in this level then? There is, little Yoshi and big Yoshi combined to be double Yoshi. So there's no way, no, 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 I can't lose both of them at once. They're my special boys. There we go. Um. Whoa, watch it. I don't know how we're gonna make this work. Why did they give you a baby Yoshi right before all of this? Okay, I'm not gonna be able to get that one. That one's gone. So like, hmm. Yeah, no, 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 no. Why do you have to run that way? Oh, that was baloney. Come on, game, you're so tough today. I don't know what's with the game today being so super duper difficult, like more than usual, I feel. <laughs> okay, get this, that's nothing. Gotta be some more stuff around here soon, right? Boing, bouncing off of that. Oh, that's a P switch. I wanted to hope, I was hoping for a power up first, but nope, it's just a P switch. I mean, I'll take, oh, come on. I am not a fan of World 3 so far. I mean, I guess it's technically not World 3 because the ice area could have been World 3 as well, but you know what? I'm kind of calling it World 3. Okay, okay. There we go, I get another Yoshi. Hopefully this one turns out a little bit better. We are going to grab this. Okay, I'm definitely gonna get that and hope that no cheap cheeps really get in my way too much. Get rid of him, go this way. You can't grab the star coin with your tongue, unfortunately. Still no power-ups. Grabbing this, grabbing those. I wanna grab them like this real fast, just so that, oh, no, 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 no! I should've just moved to the left, I could've gotten on the water. I'm the worst Mario player today. I'm, I'm the worst Luigi player, I suppose. Oh my gosh. Yoshi, come back. Okay, I got him. I missed out on the green coins. That's fine. I don't care right now. Cheap cheeps are the worst. Oh, got it. Just gotta be very careful with everything else is all. So I got that there. I don't know where this next set, not this last set, but this final star coin. I don't know where it is. Just gotta be careful. Oh boy, got it. Got it. Is that a full set? Uh, no, it's not, okay. <laughs> Oh, I do remember this. Yeah, there's a tough jump here that is made even more difficult by unpredictable cheap cheeps. They jump out at random times. What the heck is that? Why is this world so much more difficult in just the weirdest ways? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna take, I don't wanna take the propeller cap. I really don't. I didn't mean to take that. I was trying to back out. Ah, oh, <laughs> everything is difficult. Okay, so I'm gonna try this out as well as I can, I'm sorry, Yoshi, I'm so sorry, but I had to do that. I know the star coin is down here, right? Don't tell me the star coin is not down here. Don't tell me I abandoned Yoshi for nothing. No, 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 hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. That's also not what I meant to do. Who? Uh, ah, I did it! There we go! Who? I honestly feel like Luigi is so much more difficult to play. Like, this is the unannounced hard mode. I mean, maybe it's just because I've been playing as all the other characters that I'm just so used to them. This is really tough. Because the cheap cheeps are so random, and when you add like a point of unpredictability, it makes everything complicated, but we got the level done. I can breathe easy. <sighs> Let's go and get the fourth level done. Yeah, phew, that's how I feel, Luigi. It's really hard to keep up with lives with him. I mean, at this point with Toadette, we had like 35 plus lives, you know? So it, it's not easy. But we're gonna move to the left. We're gonna move down and do the fourth level, then the fifth level, and that should be much better. See, so yeah, let's try this out. It is Sparkling Waters for Urchin's Shoals. 
That's a that's like a weird tongue twister. Urchin shoals, urchin shoals. It's like a ch and the sh. That makes it confusing. Okay. So let's wait for this and get this guy. Oh, oh, already finding secrets, cool. Oh, I love the look of this area with like the overgrown grass on the stone and stuff. That actually looks really cool. I was hoping that would actually hit those guys, but I suppose it won't. I mean, it might here, because yeah, the, the the turtle shells don't travel across the water, unfortunately. It'd be cool if they did, but they don't. What about down here, what do we got? I mean, I should probably just go down this way, shouldn't I? Simple enough. Oh, you know what? Oh, and this is mini Mario? Hmm. Oh, wow. Well, walking right down the wall like that's a little weird. But there's star coin number one. And then we can just keep running and right into this pipe. That is so bizarre. <laughs> okay, so what do we got here? Just keep running to the right. I haven't done anything except for run to the right since I got mini Luigi. Isn't that weird? <laughs> there we go. I had to actually put a different input in. It was going down the pipe. Weird stuff, right? Unheard of going down pipes. It goes sideways into them, walking up waterfalls. So I don't know where this last one is. I can only hope it's not under the water because that would make things a bit more complicated for our buddy here. Okay, there's the halfway point. I suppose I will get it. Oh, they changed that. Usually getting the halfway point as a mini character would make it so that they become normal size once more, which makes me concerned maybe I shouldn't have become normal size again. Oh, I could have definitely, oh, that doesn't do anything, never mind. Because I could have definitely done something there. I don't know what I do here. Is there like a secret? Um, I definitely can go into that pipe over here then? And if I can find a way to, oh, I gotcha. Okay, let that all raise again. You gotta sort of time it correctly, and I did, and we get a one up out of it. That's pretty good. Go through this pipe and let's see what we get. We get ourselves star coin, we just gotta, time this decently, and we got it. So there we go, there's all three star coins for this level. Definitely not as tough of a level. I can just say that right now without a doubt. Definitely not as tough of a level. What is down here though? Got some mystery coins. I guess if we were still mini Mario, which would have made that last star coin a bit more tough, so I'm glad we aren't. Yeah, I'll just wait up here for a second. And then, whoa, whoa, gotta be careful. Oh, let's get these red coins. Uh, maybe not. There's somebody in the way. Excuse me, sir, I got places to be and you're not really helping. Yeah, there's no way I can get it because these guys take too long. They're too slow. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, whoa, whoa. Move it fast, Luigi. Ah, not quite a one up. That's fine. We'll get a one up next level because I'm at 99 coins. Yeah, that one was definitely easier, so it's fine. I'm happy to have gotten it done. So. Now we're gonna do Sparkling Waters 5, and then we'll go all the way back and do the special Sparkling Water level. That'll be fun. But for now, as you can see, we've got Sparkling Waters 5, Dragon Eels Undersea Grotto. Interesting. This'll be fun to check out. Dragon Eel, what's a Dragon Eel? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Let's pop down this pipe. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so what do we got going on down here? There's like some, there's both water and quicksand. Isn't that great? So we'll get a fire flower, which I already had. These guys sort of avoid you in an interesting way. No, how did how did I get hit by them there? That was weird. I feel like Luigi has a bigger hitbox as well, which, I mean, makes sense. He is the taller brother, but makes it just a little bit more. Oh gosh, that's a dragon eel. Okay, okay, gotta keep moving because I don't think he's gonna get taken out by no pesky fire flower. Oh, he can get sped up though. Huh, that's interesting. I don't know how I feel about all that. Can I go down any of these pipes? I could definitely get a lot of coins here. If Mr. Dragon Eel leaves me alone. Please do, sir. Oh, now it's just slowing him down. I guess if I hit him right in the face, it slows him down. Oh, come on. It's hard to press the button and swim at the same time. Gotta be honest. Grab this for as long as I can and then get out of here. Get, get, go, go, leave me alone. He's trying to eat me. I don't want to be eating. Gosh darn it. <laughs> oh no. Uh. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Keep going this way. Ooh, here we go. Wait, 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 wait. hold on. Leave my fire flower alone. It hasn't done anything to you, Mr. Dragon Eel. Yeah, I get it, he's like a dragon and an eel. Haha, <laughs> I don't know why it took me so long to pick that up. 
Whoa, 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 hold on. Get him out of here, right now. Be gone. Very good. So I have two out of the three star coins. And lots more left to get. <laughs> I mean, only one more star coin. But lots more level left to complete. I'm not very good at talking today, I'm sorry. Yeah, let's try to confuse him a little bit and see if I can't get these. There we go, and I got it. Not bad, one up for us. Perfect. And I probably have to go down that red pipe. I have to assume anything, it's gonna be down. And I can go down it, but is it? Yes, it is. Okay, so I'm just gonna grab this real fast. There's two dragon nails. There's, oh, okay, well, they're sort of blue. Huh, interesting, because there's more than one type of dragon eel. I don't care, though. I'm just trying to keep moving forward. I got all the star coins I needed. So if I could just get out of this level now, that would be fantastic. Oh gosh, oh gosh. We gotta see these dudes to make our way through. And he is hot on our heels. Get him out of here. He's like, ow! I know, that's sort of rude for me to do, right? Hit you in the face with a fireball? You know what's also rude? You trying to have me as lunch. So please refrain, sir. Ah, I was supposed to triple jump after out of that. But it's sort of weird how they make that happen. Like, he, the triple jump doesn't work that way. So I don't know why they set it up like that. Anyways, we got it done. And as you can see, we have uh, opened it up to the castle. So we'll go ahead and get some extra power-ups and we'll try out the special level before we deal with Larry here. But I'm glad we finally made enough progress so that we can get to this point. It felt like it took forever. Man, this has been a tough world. So we got this Baby Yoshi thing again. So just like last time, we need to be able to get the, the toad first because if we get, there's two things I'm trying to pay attention to here. No, I didn't want to put that one there. Okay, put that there. And then one of these two is a times two. I can only hope it's that one. And then I, either we get a times two mushroom or a times two flower, I don't care. Uh, only, it, it's fine, it's fine. We got the times one mushroom. That's still something, you know? So I'll gladly take that. And we'll keep moving forward. So there we go, one more mushroom to our arsenal of different items. I'm gonna march all the way back to the special level. Now all the all the cheap cheeps are back, for better or for worse, I suppose. Okay, just dodge them for now. And then we're gonna go down this way and tackle the special level. It'll be pretty cool if you ask me. I love this, this is so cool. Just running over all these different obstacles, just hopping around. And what is this? This is Sparkling Water's Leaf Skyward Stalk. This is interesting. I think I actually remember this level. This one I think stands out in my memory. Oh, I think so. You gotta climb up the cool thing. That's a really fun idea. Oh, and the level, oh not the levels, the leaves end up actually, I guess, falling off. Because I guess it's like autumn time. I like that idea, that's fun. There's another acorn just in case I needed it. Luckily I did not. Anything over there? Not quite. And then there's also these like little branches that roll in and out. I don't know if they ever break. It doesn't look like it. Okay, just gotta be careful. Got it, and got it. There's eight of them right there, and that's 25 lives in total. No star coins yet, which is a tad bit concerning, but I'm sure if we keep moving. Okay, there's one. No, excuse me, Mr. Squirrel. I got places to be. I probably want this, the the uh, thing to catch up a little bit. What is with the Goombas on balloons? <laughs> Baloombas. <laughs> I've never seen that before, that's cute. At least I don't remember seeing it. Okay, grab all these coins. And what's up here? Nothing? Nothing. All right. Oh, that's a one up, that's a one up. Yeah, I got it, cool. That's 26 lives. So Luigi definitely has been a lot more of a difficulty for me to play. But I have been enjoying myself nonetheless. It's just been challenging as well, and stressful. Which might make you think that I'm not having fun, but I am. And that's just what, you know, what games are all about, is surpassing challenges no matter how tough they may be. Okay, here's star coin number two, right? No, there was, no, wait, what did I miss out on? Oh no, no, wait, where's, where is it? <laughs> I thought I was being quite diligent, but apparently, that's a load of baloney. I gotta look through this level again then. That's such a shame. I mean, beyond that, it was quite easy. Refreshingly so, almost. So where in the world could that final star coin be? It must just be in like a little hidden area where there's a pipe or something. Can't believe I messed that up. I stink. Yeah, he made it. All right, let's try that again. Oh, hey, oh yeah, that's right. I, I finished it with a little extra. We'll probably get a star out of this. Let's hope. Oh, we get a mini mushroom. 
That's uncommon. Pretty cool. And it's pretty cool seeing Luigi in the uh, acorn suit. I don't know how, we haven't seen that too much, so that's always good to see. Anyways, keep moving with that. And where will that lead? Oh, you go up the tree, across the clouds, over the rainbow, and all the way near the train tracks into the stone world. How cool is that? You know, just like all these other cool paths. We might, we're gonna have to run through them again to check them all out at the end of the series, like once we have everything opened up. But for right now, we'll save, we'll head back into that level, and hopefully everything will turn out okay. Oh, it was just right there in the clouds? Oh, okay, well, we got it. <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, yeah, I guess I just really missed that. I don't know how I missed that. Oh, I feel so silly now. Okay, so there we go. We got the Tanoi Noi. Turn around, Luigi. That's it. <laughs> we gotta save that for later. Don't want to spoil us now. So now that we've gotten that done, we are all set, as far as I can tell. We can always pause the game once we get there to check out um, the castle. But let me see. Pause the game real fast. Take a look at our star coins, and that looks like it's the case. So let us move forward. Go up this way, and we should be good to go. Larry Koopa, you're going down as we enter Sparkly Sparkly Waters Castle, Larry's Torpedo Castle. So I guess it looks like we're probably gonna go against some Torpedo Teds here. That might be fun, it might not be fun. We'll find out. Yep, I see them down there, there those are Torpedo Teds. Let's go ahead and grab this. It's always just good to have a nice flower. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, never mind then. Maybe it's not good to have a nice flower because I don't have one. I don't know what's with me making so many mistakes in this episode, but I really feel like, like some of this is the game being tough and some of this is just me being silly. Oh, there's our first star coin. All right, I was hoping one of those would be a mushroom, neither of which were, but I do see a little extra something up here. That's just sort of a bit of a shortcut. That's appreciated. Let's go ahead and go through this pipe. And hopefully I can run into a power up as we go into this awful underwater section. There we go. Give me that mushroom. Thank you. I'm gonna keep going. So I don't know when I'm gonna use that propeller cap that I got as an item in our item selection. I'm probably gonna save it until I feel like I really need it. It seems like it's gonna be the best choice because I honestly still like it a little bit better than I like the the scroll suit, I think it's a lot more controllable in the air. I mean, obviously you don't get as many chances to sort of save yourself if you're falling to your doom, but when it comes to actually getting up higher, it definitely helps a lot more. It's a lot about vertical movement in the air. Wow, uh, the acorn seems to sacrifice some vertical movement for horizontal movement, which I'm not the biggest fan of. Okay, so what we're gonna do here is if that gets too close for comfort, we're just gonna freeze it. And it immediately breaks that frozenness, so I'm glad we didn't need that. That's scary. Okay, so this part's tough. There's a pipe up here, which I can only imagine is something good, right? Go for it. Is this star coin number three right next to star coin number two? Guess not, not, not quite. Okay. Uh, No, I missed one. <laughs> Darn it. Ooh, I thought I was gonna land on them for sure. We got it. And we can keep moving. So there's some red coins here that I'm not too enthused about the idea of grabbing them all, just because I know I'm probably gonna mess it up, but I didn't, so you know what, look at me. Grab that right there, we're at 31 lives. Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Nice. Okay, so things are going pretty well so far. I just don't like the fact that Torpedo Teds go so much faster than we do. But we're still missing that third star coin, so my eyes gotta be peeled. I'm not letting that thing slip away in any kind of cloud of smoke, or, yeah, I guess that makes sense. A little cloud of smoke anywhere. Not happening. Can we go up here? Oh, we can, oh, look at that! <laughs> there we go. No hidden walls, no clouds of smoke, no nothing. Shielding me from getting that star coin. <laughs> Wahoo! What's around here? Oh, we do have a fire flower, but to get it, I have to jump off of you. Nothing else up there? I suppose not. Okay, Larry, you're going down. I've got myself a power up. I got all three star coins. Luigi has taken some torment in this episode, but no longer. We're going on to your castle, or your castle, your, your airship, and we're taking you down. Okay, let's get to it. Ooh, <laughs> and down he goes. It'd be cool if each one had a mini airship level in it too. Like, that'd be really fun. Anyways, Larry Koopa, I'm taking you on. Dodging that, 
and just jumping on you. That was pretty good. See, I don't know how helpful the fire flower will actually be, but all this raising water definitely adds a bit of challenge. Whoa, watch it. Boing, just barely got him there. That was perfect. No, he got pushed up by the water. That does make it a bit tougher, doesn't it? Where am I? Oh, I got I was like way up there. Okay, so there he is. Oh, that is so weird. Come on, I got him. Took a lot more damage that time, but we finally took him down. Larry Koopa's defeated, and along with it, the Sparkling Waters world is also completed. A third one! Down, and whatever, we, we took it down. <laughs> okay, man, has it been a challenging episode? And it looks like Larry Koopa can't handle no more. He's riding off, oh, he's going down, watch out! Oof, that must hurt. Okay, but do we get the happy dance for completing everything? I sure hope so. Uh, yes we do! You got all the star coins and sparkling waters, of course that's a good thing. So before we head to the right and tackle whatever world is there, we actually have to backtrack a little bit because of course, we wanna go ahead and take a look at our next world in the next episode because you know it branched off into two paths, so before we move on to the world that's ahead, we need to go down this way. As you can see, it's gonna be Frosted Glacier. We already read it before, so I might as well spoil it. But yeah, that'll be a lot of fun. I love Frozen Worlds, and we'll be checking out another new character. Most likely, I think it's gonna be Blue Toad. So that'll be fun. But for now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Luigi Zebra, so now you've watched at the end of the you're a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.